Hello everyone. In this video, we'll be seeing about password reset for the Huawei devices using Dolling Care. Before we start, let's see more details about some do's and don'ts and some prerequisites. All right. So first thing is first. When you create an account in Dolling Care, we need to make sure the account which you create is authenticated. So in order to get authenticated, you will need the email address um, of the distributor and uh, the invitation code of the distributor so you might have to use one of the two right so here in your dolink uh, care web interface you can click on company and uh, click on uh, this icon person icon and then uh, you can type the email address of the distributor it will automatically paste the invitation code and you can click on OK. Sometimes it will be the, the vice versa. You will be asked to enter the invitation code and uh, it will uh, tell you the distributor's email. Once this is done, you can click on OK and uh, probably within some time your account will be authenticated. So this is the first step. Okay. Second step is here we have four scenarios. Out of the four scenarios, only one scenario will work. So scenario one is with internet connection and uh, devices on the same network and uh, same subnet. All right. So here we have on the Huawei device, which is connected either by wired or wireless connection to your router, and on the same network, either your mobile device is connected by Wi-Fi or your laptop or any other PC is connected by wired or wireless yes. connection. In this case, you'll be able to reset the device password. This is acceptable. And we have scenario two, where the whole device and the link are on different network. In this scenario, we will not be able to do password reset. And then we have scenario three, where like we have one network, but two different subnet. The device is in subnet one and uh, the Dolink app is on another subnet. In this case, we will not be able to do the password reset. And scenario four is like without internet connection. Although all the devices are on the same network, we will not be able to do password reset if the router is not connected or the device is not connected to the internet, right? So let's see the next prerequisite. So you will be asked to upload a photo of the label of the device so you need to make sure a clear photo of the label is being uploaded here you can see the first photo the label is um, clear right so this is acceptable so the we have took a photo of the same label where the image is blurred so this is not accepted the second image is not accepted you need to have a clear hd image and if you are trying to upload a uh, photo like this sometimes it may not get accepted because it's um, taking the full um, photo right so it may it may not get accepted maybe it may get accepted but definitely the first image will get accepted because it focuses only on the device label right so try to upload this particular uh, an image similar to this right so let's dive in so once you're in your uh, do link uh, care um, web interface you can click on tools. Once you click on tool under config tools, probably you'll be asked to click on start search. Once you click on start search, like you'll be, um, it will show the list of devices which are connected to your network, right? So here um, you can click on hover your mouse mouse over here and click on forget forgot password, and then it will ask to upload. Uh, Credential take a photo, snapshot of the device label. You can click on this And then you can click on this and upload the photo So here I already put the HD image of the label so I can click on this and I click on ok And you'll be asked to enter in the new password. 
to enter the new password. And device password has been reset. You can see it's very simple. The password reset is a very simple process and uh, you can do in a matter of time, uh, less than uh, two minutes, we can finish the whole process. All right. If there's anything, feel free to write in the comments. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day. Bye.